Hey guys, this is Jack from FEV Academy in partnership with GetFEV.com. Today we're going to have a closer look at the Lumineer Graphene batteries. Now we're all waiting for that big breakthrough in battery technology and it just hasn't happened yet. There has been a small breakthrough which happened uh, quite a while ago already but it wasn't the massive breakthrough that we were imagining of having twice the amount of flight time, three times the amount of performance and all those really wonderful things that we all want in a battery. Unfortunately that hasn't happened yet but there are some really slow advantages in battery technology and graphene in a battery is definitely one step in the right direction. So let's look a little bit more at these specific graphene batteries from Luminaire. Now these Luminaire graphene series of LiPo batteries push the limits of battery technology by utilizing carbon in the structure of the cells. With the addition of graphene, the battery has improved attributes such as a higher energy density, lower internal resistance, higher discharge rates and a longer life cycle. Now that may sound all good and you might be thinking oh that's maybe just all marketing nonsense trying to sell more batteries but I can attest to this I have personally flown these batteries and they definitely last quite a bit longer than your normal line of batteries. Now the batteries that I used to fly are always at that 275C racing series that was my old bunch of batteries and those did last quite well and I probably got around 100 to 150 cycles out of each battery but these ones have a lot more cycles on them already and they are lasting just a lot better. So you definitely get quite a bit longer lives out of them. Now one thing that you may be wondering is well what is graphene? So let me just try and break that down for you. So graphene is composed of a sheet of carbon atoms bound together in a honeycomb lattice pattern and is recognized as a wonder material due to the myriad of astonishing attributes it holds including improvements to batteries. It is a very potent conductor of electrical and thermal energy. It's extremely lightweight and chemically inert and flexible with a large surface area. So simply put, it's a material in the batteries that definitely gives it a lot more cooler attributes, which makes it stand out from the rest of the batteries on the market. So if you are looking for a battery that lasts a little bit longer than the others and just in overall higher quality, then these are definitely the batteries that you want to consider. There's quite a lot of different milliamp hour uh, sizes of this battery. The ones that I specifically fly are the 1500s. I normally get around two minutes of flight time with them just depending how hard I fly but they are definitely great all-round batteries where you're going to be flying freestyle or if you want to race and you just want a high performing battery. Now if you are interested in purchasing this battery it is available at the getfpv.com website. I'll leave a link in the description below if you do want to check it out. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.